Today's words are objective and subjective. What do they mean? Where do you use them? What is subjective and objective information? Let's find out these and more. Hi there, welcome to TELW The English Workshop with me, Manu, your English coach. In this series of vocabulary videos, we are going to look at individual words or phrases and discuss around six aspects. Pronunciation, meaning, the primary use, using the word or phrase in a sentence, a few relevant questions, if any, and some synonyms. Again, if any. Let's start. Pronunciation. How do you pronounce the words? It's objective. The second syllable is stressed. Subjective. Again, second syllable is stressed. What do you mean? Objective means to be unbiased and rational. You base your observations on hard evidence and logic. There's no place for emotions. But subjective is just the opposite. Your observations are based on emotions and feelings. For instance, that's a chocolate cake is an objective statement. It simply tells what the thing is. But I love chocolate cakes is a subjective sentence. This feeling exists only in the mind. It's a sentiment, a sensation. It's used in very general terms. There's no specific field of use. Let's look at some sentences to know how it's practically used. First is objective. The computer gives an objective analysis of the situation. Ask a third party for an objective decision. DNA fingerprinting is an objective and foolproof identification process. Subjective. We can't take any action on your observations because they are very subjective. The idea of fun is subjective because there is no standard measure available. Our data could have errors because the decisions we made were subjective. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell icon to get more such videos regularly. Also, don't forget to use these words in your daily conversations. That's the only way you can make these words to your list of active vocabulary. Remember, you've got to own it to use it. Merely watching this video once and passing over to another will not help you. Now let's look at one relevant question. What is subjective and objective information? Subjective information is a mixture of facts and opinions, feelings and emotions. They are not measurable or observable. So, they are not useful in hardcore decision making in a business or political scenario. They are found mostly in blogs, editorials and biographies. Objective information, on the other hand, is purely fact-based. They are quantifiable and perceptible. They are usually found in news articles, encyclopedias and school textbooks. Now let's look at some synonyms here. For objective, detached, dispassionate, unbiased, non-partisan, open-minded, disinterested. And for subjective, abstract, instinctive, personal, idiosyncratic, biased, fanciful. Thank you for watching this video, liking it and subscribing to our channel. We'll see you in the next video. Until then.